meteorologist, Miss Katie Whitaker, with your official Red Hook High School and Mid Hudson Valley forecast for the week of October 19th, 2020. I am reporting from near the weather station here at Red Hook High School, and that's actually where I got the observations from for this morning at around 9:20 a.m. So let's take a look at those first. So this morning our temperature was around 54 degrees Fahrenheit. Again, this is on Monday at around 9:20 a.m. Winds were out of the south. You'll notice that the sunrise and sunset. That time gap is getting shorter as you're probably noticing like I am. The days are much, much shorter with sunrise shortly after 7 and sunset right around 6 p.m. You'll notice that the moon phase is in the waxing crescent phase, meaning light is on the right in a C shape and we're working our way towards a full moon, which will occur on Halloween this year. Let's bring it to that surface map and see what's going on with the weather. You'll notice a cold front draped across New York State. Hanging off towards the west, I think most of the moisture will stay off to the west with it, but that's leading to this increased cloud cover here on Monday, and I think it could set off some showers on your Tuesday as it flirts with the area. So again, I think it's going to get kind of hung up in the Catskills. That's due to high pressure down you'll see in the southeast as well as off the Atlantic coastline, and that will keep most of the precip out, but you can't rule out some showers. And really, I'm keeping that chance in for pretty much the whole week, just a very slight chance of some showers getting set off by this front that has turned stationary. That means it's just not really moving. It's pretty stagnant. It's hung up, again, being blocked by that high pressure. You'll notice out in the upper Midwest, that dark blue means snow is likely. So we're starting to see that cooling trend happen towards the central part of the United States. By the time that storm system gets here, it will warm up and we're not expecting any snowfall here in the Northeast anytime soon. But starting to notice those trends off towards the higher elevations and towards the West with snow and ice starting to come into the forecast. So we'll have to hang tight for that. Let's get to that five day forecast. So for your Tuesday again, wouldn't be surprised if we saw some showers passing through, um, but they may stay off to the east. We'll just have to wait and see on that one again. It's kind of touchy with that stationary front and where it sets up that will make all of the difference. I think your temperatures for your Tuesday will be in the mid 60s. For your Wednesday, more clouds and sun I would say with that front hanging off. Uh, but temperatures will warm up slightly to near 70. For Thursday, partly sunny. Highs in the upper 60s and you'll see lows in the low to mid 50s. For your Friday, partly sunny skies continue with highs in the mid 60s, low again in the lower 50s. And for your Saturday, it looks like another system starts to redevelop from that front that sort of stalled out here, the energy, energy transfers and could set up to see some showers on Saturday, but it is definitely way too far out to tell. And for Sunday, it looks like high pressure builds in, but again, a lot can change between now and then. Thank you so much for tuning in to Weather with Whitaker, and I'll see you again next week. RHBC, back to you.